Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. After creating an accountant's copy of your company file, later on you must import your accountant's changes back into your company file to restore full functionality to your original company file. If your accountant sends you a file, insert the copy of the changes that your accountant gave to you on the removable media, for example a flash drive, then open your company file and select File from the menu bar, Roll down to Accountant's Copy and choose the Import Accountant's Changes from Files. You must make a backup before you can import the Accountant's Changes. So make the backup file and then navigate to the folder or drive that contains the file with the changes and double click on that file to open it and import the changes. At that point, the Accountant's Changes pending message in the title bar of the company file will disappear. That means that you have successfully imported your accountant's changes. If you receive the changes from the internet by using the file transfer feature, then you will receive an email from your accountant informing you that the changes to the accountant's copy are complete and that you have changes to import. At that point, you have 30 days to import the accountant's changes into your company file. To download these changes, open your company file and then select File, roll down to Accountants Copy, and choose the Import Accountants Changes from Web command from the menu bar. After the download is completed, you will see a listing of the Accountants Changes appear within your company file. You will also note that the Accountants Changes pending message will also have disappeared from the title bar of your company file. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.